What's up, everyone, and welcome back to episode 11 of The Road to SSL. Today, I've got two really exciting announcements. Number one, in this video, we're going through the final push to GC, and I thought this stream was a great example of how to win against players that are a lot more mechanical, so it should be good, especially if you're in, like, the C2, C3 area. But also, announcement number two, when this video drops, this also marks the official drop of my new coaching program called the GCR. 2.0. As many of you know, the GCR or Grand Champ Roadmap was my live coaching program that helped almost 2,000 plat through champ rank players rank up in just six weeks or less. But today I'm super excited to announce we've completely remastered the curriculum for our 2.0 launch and our newest coach, Apparently Jack, is hosting a 60 minute live training in just a few weeks for everyone inside this coming season. So if you're watching between the plat through champ ranks and you want to learn how to get that GC or even SSL title, this is the best time ever to get involved. DM me on Discord with the keyword V2 and we can talk details about coaching. Also, to celebrate launch 2.0, I'm giving the first 100 people who DM me $100 off the normal cost of enrollment. So I'll have my Discord linked at the top of the description below. DM me with the keyword V2 and someone on my team will send you the details. Hope to see you inside this coming season. Otherwise, Enjoy the video, guys. You got game one here, playing with VIP Maniac, Maniac against Youngblood and Youngblood and LeBron. <laughs> Let's get it. Here we go. Get decent kickoff. Gonna play half boost here. I'm actually going to turn on this ball because nobody's here. Just put a shot on net. He gets a nice save. Going to take his boost. Look for where my teammate is. My teammate looks like he wants, so I'll let him go. I'm just going to make sure I get this touch off to the side. And he goes straight for a shot, which is a mistake. So I'll play this back to my corner with the soft touch. Then I see him challenging, so I'll hit it out. And now I'm just going to follow this ball. I'm not trying to get mechanical. Um, that should have been a goal for us if my teammate's playing farther back, but I didn't get a good 50 there. I could have got a better 50 right here. Put it off to the side. Uh, this should bounce center. He looks like he's missing. I see he's missing. Just go for a shot. Almost get it. Bump him out a little bit. Driving back now. Gonna grab half boost and move in. Uh, gonna wait back here because there's a lot of chaos. I want to go for this ball. I just want to wait till it's safe. Get one soft touch and then a simple double jump to propel it forward. I'll lead to a goal. I'll go across. I'm gonna move back here. He looks for shot. He actually misses. Just gonna jump off, wave dash. That's just in. Rip. I could have recovered better here. Give him a nice shot. Move on. Get a nice 50. I'm cautious my teammate's gonna miss here, so that's why I'm getting in the way. I'm gonna play backboard. Just try to intercept him a little bit. Fair enough. You always want to assume the miss, especially at these ranges. Just assume the miss and cover, especially if, you know, the, the stakes are high. A lot of people like to blame their teammates, but it's like, just assume they're missing. You know, assume assume your, assume your teammate's missing. I don't know why I was going for a shot from that far away. It's fine. He looks like he's first, so I'm just going to go back. I don't trust his mechanics, so I'll just wait. Let him toss ball. He plays it back. My teammate should have. Nice. Let's see what my teammate does. Maybe go for a flick. Good try. Teammate gets their corner boost, so I'll take half. I'm just controlling boost, controlling boost. He's got nothing here. He's literally zero boost, just overextended in my corner. So now I can cut, cut, go. He's so confused. I could put it left, right. He's not shadowing well on one side. He's in the middle of his net, so I can just kind of split him in half. Or, I mean, he is in the middle of his net. You want to be, uh, you want to be off to one side if at all possible in those situations. So that way the net's always in front of you. He looks like he's booming, so I'm just going to wait back. Looks like he has one follow-up, so fair. I'll just wait back. He's going. He misses. Get one touch over. See a guy. I hear a guy coming. I could have gone quicker there, but it's fine. Only going because I hear him going. That guy's touch is really bad. Feeds it right to my teammate. All right, that'll play. I'll come center here. He's flying early. Like, no reason to fly, dude. I'll just let him go. Like, sick, you got a double, but now you're in my corner with zero boost. And we should have almost a 2v1. 
Nice, hits it over my net. Hit one here. Slow 50M. Little speed change. Puts it right in it. Fifty off to the side. This might be tough for my teammate. I'm gonna try to get in the way. Save jump. Alright, so the ball's gonna come here. I can play it off to the side. I'm gonna go for a very simple air dribble here. Just simple air roll. I, I feel like that's not too mechanical. I didn't use any air roll, didn't use nothing. I see it's it off far, so I'm just gonna cut and try to play it to an awkward spot where they can't get an easy shot off. Works pretty well, and then my teammate just makes that hit, which is really bad. So I'll just play that. Watch out. Hit it forward. Wants to pass back, kind of. Once again, like, see, like, these these challenges are just... They're very predictable. And I'm going to bump him out. My teammate should have open if he's there. But somehow he gets beat instead. Alright, here I'm just watching that. Please challenge me. Thank you for challenge. Now we have a 2v1. My teammate's quick. Kind of plays it forward. That's fine. Now my teammate's out overextended, so I'm just going to delay. Delay, delay, delay. Oh, I could have been back quicker. I'll play it across. He's going to probably boom for no reason. So I can get a cut across. Here I'm going to go early just to force. Just to get in his face. Timmy needs to challenge. Looks awkward. Might get a flick over. Let's see? It's a nice flick. Can't really go here while they're up. I can get one touch over. Get a hit up. Go for a tough shot. Probably could have scored there. But it is what it is. Teammate looks like he still has. Nice, we'll play close. Goes for another 45. Almost gets it. Just gonna try to get in his way here. Nothing too mechanical. Teammate almost gets a boom, but I'm gonna turn back here. Okay, so nobody is on me here, so I'll play one off the wall. And I think he's challenging, so I'll play one up. I'm just gonna go for a 50. Play back here. Teammate centers. He's got one more. And I think that'll be game. Unfortunate loss. Got balls of Rune and then Box and Archon on the other team. Alright. Ball's gonna come here. I'm just gonna get a 50, wave dash down. Just gonna focus on staying near him and just disrupting as much as I can. He's gonna grab boost. That's fine. Make sure we don't overcommit. Keep recovering. Nice, he plays it off to the side. Just get a good 50. Keep following it. Just trying to get it away from the center here. Maybe get a pass to my teammate, but it's fine even if not. I can rotate back behind him. Teammate goes for a ceiling. Almost gets it. This guy makes too heavy of a touch there, so I can kind of cut it off. Teammate should have, and I'm looking for a demo. Actually get one there. Um, and my teammate, I don't think my teammate got boost, which is fine. I'll challenge there because I see the ball's kind of out far. And I'm going to look for a demo here because he's awkward. Don't quite get it. Get behind my teammate. And there's a lot of smoke here, so I'm going to challenge early if I can. Because I'm going to assume he doesn't have time to set up a beat. So, it's best to challenge early. Let him drive right into me. Get a low 50-50. Drive up. And then... I The wave dash down there is a little mechanical. We'll go for this one. Hit it off to the side. I'm going to go up like I'm going. Come right back down. Watch him. Just get a low 50 there. We'll give it right to my teammate. Who gets, dem <laughs> gets dunked immediately. That's okay. Here I see everybody going. So I'm just going to wait and play play smart while everybody else challenges. Um, we're going to say that was a nice click. Teammates jumping around a lot, which is totally fine. Just going to play the ball here. Put it up where, you know, they don't really have a setup immediately. Jump like I'm going. Wait, 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 wait. Get it on the up bounce. Try to play it around him. Couldn't quite play it around him. That's alright. Might be able to get a demo here. Not quite. I'm gonna go all the way back because this play is developing slow, so I'll have time to get back in. And he just scores it anyways. Cheat up. I'll play into the corner. I'm gonna try to get back quick in case my teammate does get beat here. I'm gonna watch Nat. Nice, he hits it forward. 
So I think I can just go for a shot. Did I miss that? That is awkward. I think we're okay. Ooh. Nice save. Give him a what a save on that and move on. Here, I, I was going because I thought he was challenging, but once he's not, we can wait. I'm trying to play this ball to my teammate. My recovery is a little sus here. I think we'll be back. To make it speed. I'm just going to play wide, so I'm in net the whole time. I think it's a nice clear. Continue to watch net. Play back post. Should be fine. Do 50. All right, now we'll play up here. He looks like he might boom, so I'll play close. Here, I'm just disrupting. I'm just trying to get him to flick. And that'll give my teammate a shot. My shot, bro. Here, I'm not actually trying to challenge. I'm just trying to get him scared and make him flick, which is exactly what happens. Then I can make it awkward, and we'll get a goal. And that'll be a forfeit. Right. We're with Jamone against Scudickle and PVR. This should be our uh, rank up game. So we'll see. He's going to get a nice beat. I'm going to go center here like he thought he was missing. So, works out. <laughs> Are you on stream? <laughs> My roommate said you have, to, you have to start streaming when I'm actually awake. So I'm streaming just for him. Nice, I'm going to get ball. I can't do anything mechanical here, so I'm just going to play down. I'm going to go for a tough shot. Make him awkward. Get a demo. And that's, like, so, that's a play that you can go for even if you don't have max, you know? He's going to go. They're just over committing super hard. <laughs> I think I just missed the open. Whoops. <laughs> Sorry, fellas. <laughs> Sorry, folks. And then I cut him off. All right. I'm playing like a true, <laughs> like a true champ three right now. <laughs> All right. Focus back up. Sorry. I get distracted. Uh, he plays down. Should have ball here. Going to watch him. All right. He bumps me. That's totally fine. Teammate should have here. No problem. Fiji's gonna go out to the side. I'm gonna turn back because it looks like he might boom. She does. Just gonna play it to the corner with the soft touch. My teammate should have a better angle. He does. Nice. He'll play it off to the side. This gives me free ball. Could have gone for a beat a little sooner. That's alright. Probably should have jumped a little sooner. Here, I'm just trying to force. I'm not actually trying to go. Once again, I'm just a body, so that way my teammate gets a free shot. Puts a nice shot on. I can't really go. I can maybe take his boost here and try to get it over to my teammate. I'm going to hit it to the side here. Fake like I'm going. Turn back. I'm just going to wait till he goes. Bop it off the wall. That puts it by one. I almost get it by the second. Look for a demo on the second. Here, I'm just looking for a demo. I'm not actually trying to hit him. Get a demo on the one. Looks like he's booming. I just don't like the... like. No, if nobody's pressuring, you really don't want to boom like that. I want to show, like, once again, these guys are just flying, but it's, like, for no reason. Like, I'm just going to control boost, bump them around. My teammate has a breakaway now. Get it in time. Almost. Ball's going to come back center. Looks like he's going. He completely whiffs. Fair enough. Still looking for a demo on me. Fake like I'm going again. I can just boom it high. Over. Make him awkward. Teammate has a free. Free shot. Play back here. They'll hit it across. My teammate's low boost, so I'm just gonna delay. Get one big pop up, turn to the left so I don't get demoed, and then fly after it. Pretty good. I can take his corner boost. Somehow my teammate gets beat there. What just happened? <laughs> oh, he gets a nice recovery, I guess. Nice recovery. Cheat up. Get in the way of one. Watch shot from the second. We're fine. Teammate should have open if he can go quick enough. Almost. Ball's gonna come around the side. I'm just gonna put it off backboard once again. Make it awkward because nobody's there. He'll hit it off to the side. My teammate should have easier than me. Watching a boom from him. See, I'm just watching boom. Once I see him do going, I will challenge though because that means two are committed from them. So even if I get beat, it's still 1v1. Move up like I'm challenging. I gotta get a save. I'm just gonna try to cover the angle there. Uh, decent kickoff. I'm gonna have to get back here pretty quick. Just get behind my teammate. 
be it's a decent beat. You should be able to get a 50 here. Nice, it's it over one. I'll play pretty aggro. We get one here. I'm gonna hit it hard off the wall, that way I can follow it. Get a beat over one. My teammate is open if he's quick. He's not quick enough. It's fine, I'm just gonna go back because the bounce is awkward. Gonna watch boom. Teammate should have. It's not the best save. I have to use a squ I, I don't have to use a squishy there. You don't have to do what I did to get that out. You could just use a normal save. I do use a little bit of mechanics though. I'm gonna go up. It's an okay challenge. I probably could have waited. Probably didn't need to challenge. I thought it might be favorable. He might just miss that fully. I'm just gonna try to get the center as quick as possible. Maybe look for a demo. Oh, can't get it. Teammate should challenge. Can't quite yet. I get one touch up. Can't quite get it. Get a decent 50. My teammate's got another open. That'll play. All right, we finally got a got a one goal lead going into the back half. Try not to uh, jinx it, but play left. Just gonna buy time for my teammate here. I know my teammate's awkward. Put it in the corner. It's gonna be really hard for them to get an angle anytime quickly on a ball like this. Gonna hit it up one. Get another beat. <laughs> and that'll work. <laughs> oh wait. Alright, ball's coming here. I'm just gonna delay, put it in my corner, get a 50. They don't have anything here. Should be totally fine. And that'll be game! Is that the GC game? Maybe? Let's go! Let's go! Skadoodle is toxic. But we got it, GC won! A little up and down on this stream, but hopefully, up until this point, you know, I people have been saying I've been using a little too many mechanics, you know, this and that. Hopefully that was reasonable. I thought that was a pretty reasonable showing. All right, so that covers it. We are now GC in the road to SSL. And hey, as a bonus for making it to this point in the video, I wanna let you know, I just dropped a completely free video training that recaps the top five strategies I've been using SAR in this series to rank up without mechanics. If you want access to that free video training, I actually just dropped a link over in my private Discord. So if you haven't yet and you want to check that video or you just want to join the Discord, click the link below because it's completely free to join and you can leave whenever you want. Otherwise, follow the Twitch to catch these live. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll catch you in the GC games for episode 12. Peace, guys.